Hello, Hoosters. How y'all doing? Come on in with the new movie. Hey, y'all. How y'all doing today? Okay, y'all. The movie today is from Burns Junk Closet. If you don't know her, I'm going to put her a name down in the description box. She is so wise, so fun and funny. She gives you instructions to learn uh, these YouTube stuff and she's just a great teacher and of course she is the YouTube cheerleader. So check her out. She's wonderful. So yeah, look, look like I'm, I'm peeping behind that board, huh? Okay, y'all, this is Vern's Junk Closet, 20 questions and um, she said, think before you answer. I think that's what it was. Okay, y'all. So look here. This is scene one. Take one. Let's roll the tape. All right, y'all. I pulled up these questions. So, so here we go. I love doing this stuff. I ain't lying. I do. I just love it. All right, y'all. So this is this uh, challenge was also created by Burns Junk Closet as well. Okay. So uh, I'm going to have to shout out I think she said six people, so let me see who I'm going to shout out. I probably don't, I don't know who's going to do the questions. So, living my best life, uh, Mama Dale, um, eating good, kicking it with Lynn, uh, it's Vanjie's world. Y'all know I was a part of them, right? And one more. Who is it? Uh, and she. That my six people. Come on. All right, y'all. Look here. Without ado, let's go. Uh, oh, y'all. Y'all see I did my hair this morning as well. Mm -hmm. Question number one. Have you ever been in a fight and lost? <laughs> I used to fight my butt off, y'all, on the bio, walking to and from school. I have won every fight except for one. That girl whooped my behind, and I ran home and got a butcher knife, and I chased her down the street. My mama had to come and grab me because I was about to kill her because I was so embarrassed because she beat me up. <laughs> and that's a true story. <laughs> oh, God. Poor memories, right? Uh, question number two, have you ever been in the back seat of a police car? Yes, I had tickets that I didn't pay and a warrant was put out for my arrest. So yeah, I was only there for a couple hours. So yeah. Next question, have you ever rolled on a motorcycle? <laughs> oh yeah, I'll straddle a motorcycle, a horse and a man. Come on. <laughs> Y'all, sometimes I just tickle myself. Yes, I rode a motorcycle and we'll ride again. Next one. Have you ever been in the newspaper or on TV? Well, when I was a bartender uh, on Halloween, um, we used to dress up. And so one of the papers here in Houston back in the day uh, was called the Good Times or the Something Times. And uh, they came in and uh, put us in their uh, their newspaper. So, yes, I've been uh, in the newspaper. And I had a show on 43.5 digital channel called uh, Living Single, Living Safe. That was my TV show. So, yes, I've done both. Have you ever spent the night alone in a hotel, motel, or a holiday in... Yeah, because I love going on vacation by myself. I have done it for many years and getting ready to do it, do it again. Just as soon as they give us the green light. Have you ever received a speeding ticket? No, my ticket's just been back in the day for no, uh, no driver's license. Have you ever been married, divorced, or a widow? I have been married and now a widow. Yes. Yeah. Have you ever watched a human or animal give birth? Yes, I had a dog, a beautiful a chihuahua. Her name was Mama. 
and uh, I watched her give birth to three babies and it was a beautiful thing and uh, my first grandbaby I watched her being born as well that is a true blessing when you see life man coming out of a woman's womb that she carried for nine months huh <sighs> beautiful absolutely beautiful next one Have you ever ridden in an ambulance? I have not. Praise God, I have not. Mm -mm. Have you ever been on a cruise? I haven't. And I'm kind of iffy about that. I've always desired to go on a cruise, but I can't swim, y'all. And I've heard so many stomach viruses happens on those cruises. And then I think about the slave ships of all the history that I've studied. I don't know if I even want to go on one, y'all. Have you ever swam in the ocean? <laughs> I know I can't swim. <laughs> have you ever seen karaoke? Oh my God, y'all know I love to sing, right? I have done karaoke in so many parties and I think they just clapped for me because I sing so good off tune. I have done karaoke and I am bad. <laughs> I cannot sing, but I do it just for the fun of it. When was the last time you cried? I cry a lot when I'm on my knees uh, praying to God. Uh, sometimes I just start to pray and I start to be so thankful and, and, you know, the tears just flow. They do. Sometimes tears, they cleanse, they heal. I mean, if you have to cry, cry out, you know, yell it out, do something. Get, get, it just is it's really spiritual, I believe. So I cry a lot when I'm looking at love stories and stuff like that. Yeah, because, you know, I'm, I'm a lover of love. It's a beautiful thing. So I cry for that, too. <laughs> Have you ever danced in the rain? Oh, yes. Yes. But how many women today will say, I'm not going to mess up my hair. I just got my weave done. I just got my perm done, baby. Hmm, all that can be dry with a dryer set under under a dryer, press, hot comb, and whatever comb, comb, and comb. Uh, dance in the rain. It's, it's, it's so refreshing. Yeah. Are you a member of the Mile High Club? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. What is the Mile High Club? <laughs> have you ever stolen money? Let me think about that. Now, this one I really have to think about. I don't necessarily, I don't think I necessarily, well, yeah, I have y'all, but I can't tell y'all where I got it from. I'm going to my grave with it, but God knows. Yeah, I had to think about that one. Have you ever thrown food away that a family member cooked? So y'all, let me tell you. I was invited to a dinner and uh, everybody had their they plates stacked so high and they was eating the food and I was excited because it looked like everybody liked the food. And But I'm, I, I always start off with just a spoon of everything, you know, because if I like it, I'll go back for more. Yeah, it wasn't good. So I, you know how you just holding your mouth and when I'm not nobody looking, and I'm this is this is real talk. Nobody not looking. You act like you're wiping your mouth. You just put it in the napkin. Mm. Yeah. The next one. Have you ever been bitten by a dog or stung by a bee? I've never been bitten by a dog. I'm trying to remember. Is it any time when I was young? If I was stung by a bee, and if I was, I really, I really don't remember. Honey, I have slept many years since then. Next question. Have you ever swore or cussed in front of your parents? My son has done it in front of me. Well, actually, he's cursed me. He has. One of them. My young son, that is. Well, my middle son cusses now when he's, you know, expressing himself. 
Have I ever cursed in front of my mother? I want to say I maybe use one or two words, but y'all know my background. So not to say that it's okay because it's never okay. But yes, I have. Last question, number 20. Have you ever done a good deed like pay for groceries, gas, or a layaway items? Well, I've never... Uh, have I gave somebody some gas? Wait a minute, wait a minute. I have paid for gas before. What was the other one? I've never paid for anybody's layaway, though. I don't know if I've even done a layaway before. If I have... Shoot, I had to be so young. I think when Kmart was still open. Is that, y'all remember Kmart? I think, child, that was so long ago. Have you ever done a pay for, now, I've never paid for grocery, but so many times I've been put into a position where someone in front of me didn't have enough money and I just told the cashier, I got it, I got it, and I got it. And, and you know, that's what we are supposed to do. We are supposed to help our brothers and sisters. So. Uh, yeah, and I'll do it again and again and again. Even uh, if I get to a red light where, you know, it's many people here in, in, in Houston, uh, in some of the areas that stand at the red lights and stuff, you know, and they look poor. And some of them do it just for the business. I've seen the movie on that. But sometimes if the spirit hit me, I know discernment. He blessed me with it. And sometimes I do give money even to the ones that's, uh, under the bridge, y'all, I do, you know, especially when the spirit says this is the one. So, yeah, Vern's Junk Closet, thank you for these questions. These were really good, in-depth questions. It does make you think about some of the things, you know. So, yay. So, y'all, my six people, I called y'all out. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be waiting for your video. But when you do this video, don't forget to hashtag Vern's Junk Closet when you do it. Okay? So look here, y'all. We're about to say goodbye for now. We've had another chance around. I'll see y'all on the other side when I get ready to do my food today. I love y'all. Peace out.